Last episode in the Aurelius project, I showed you my clay model of the car I designed. Before we get to building the full-size car, I have to make this. Let's get started. Here's all the stuff I use. It's all from Smooth On. This is not a sponsored video, but uh, I love their products and very happy to be using them. Even though it may not seem like it, a lot of the processes I'm using in this video will apply to building other car parts later on. So this is relevant, even though this is just a model. As you can see, I've got the bottom filled in with some foam core. This is just to keep the brushable mold from going under the car. And you can see back here, I've got a little trench and that will come into play a little bit later on. I'll explain later. Mix this stuff up one to one, very easy, very simple mixing. Make sure that you scrape the sides of the cup very well because you don't want anything to be uncured. It would be catastrophic. The first layer goes on very, very light, just a very thin coat, just to make sure it gets into all the tiniest details. And then you can be a little messier with the, the later coats. Pop all the air bubbles you see and keep on going. I think I did five full coats of this. So it took a long time. It's like 60 minutes between coats. As you can see, it sort of thickens itself over time. This is about half an hour into this uh, particular coat and it will just kind of drip down. And I just kept on pulling it up. Afterwards, I cut it to make it a little nicer on the edges and I tested it to see how tough it was and it's a lot tougher than I thought. So very good stuff. This is the Freeform Air. It's a sculpting epoxy dough. Basically mix it together one to one and apply this as a mother mold. Um, this is just to make sure that the car, when you are casting it, is the same shape as the, as the original. Otherwise, it would just be a floppy mold. I put some tape around the edges here where the flanges would meet and um, I built four parts to bolt together. Once I bolted it together, it's time to cast the resin. This is Smooth On's Onyx Fast. A little bit of silicone spray to keep it from sticking. Mix it up and pour it in. And this is where that ledge comes into play in the back, as you can see. Um, it keeps it from spilling out very much. It still spilled some, but keeps it from being too bad when it uh when I do this roto roto molding roto casting and I did I think four four or five coats of this as well to make sure it covered everything the first one I pulled out I'm cutting up to test out some things some fitment stuff but this one is not the the, the one that will be 3d scanned this one is painted I spared you all the the uh, grueling sanding and all that to make sure this thing was mostly perfect but um, here it is in its final form this will be 3d scanned and then scaled up so that we can start building the real car with real aluminum very excited to start that hopefully you guys are excited to see it and speaking of that the next video this is the one of the mirrors i will be building the very first real part of this car in aluminum in the next video and while you're here check out this music video i made to promote this project if you'd like to pick up your copy of an mp3 of this song, please pick it up at the link below the video. Enjoy.